They are a symbol of the American West and the largest animals in North America. What are we talking about? American, American bison. This is our dad, and he's an artist. He likes to sculpt with clay. I like to sculpt too. He paints, and sometimes he animates. We like to go to wild places and to see wild animals that live there. And with our pens and pencils, our cans and clay, we learn about nature. So come with us on our adventure because this is wild art. Today on Wild Art, we're going to learn about the American bison. Bison were first called buffaloes in the 1600s, but bison are only distantly related to the Asian and African buffaloes. Scientists like to call them bison, but many people still call them American buffalo. Whatever you call them, they are amazing animals. Let's learn more about the bison through art. It's time to draw. Everyone get your supplies, pens, pencils, crayons, and paper. Good. Now is everyone ready to draw with me? Great! Remember, it doesn't have to look exactly like what I draw. Think of it as guidelines. Remember, be your own artist. You guys keep drawing. We'll check in with you guys later. I want you to think of large shapes at the beginning. We're going to use shapes as an underdrawing. Let's do a big simple shape for the head. A nice big simple shape defining the hump and forelegs. A nice oval shape for the stomach, and then a nice simple shape for the hindquarters and tail. The most prominent feature on a bison is their large hump. One of the reasons why their humps are so large is to support their massive heads, which can weigh up to 400 pounds. Their heads come in handy as a battering ram and also a snowplow. They have beady eyes and a hairy goatee which hangs from their chins. Their forelegs are covered in the same thick fur that covers their humps. Bison have a large rounded stomach or I should say stomachs. They have, after all, four stomachs, just like a cow. The hind legs are big and muscly and finished with a long tail that has an end like a paintbrush. Wow, Ben, that's a great drawing. Smay, that's excellent. Alice, I love that drawing. Good work, guys. Bison are the largest animals in North America, weighing over 2,200 pounds. They can run up to 40 miles per hour. Bison are very dangerous. More people are hurt by bison in Yellowstone National Park than by any other animal. How does a bison take a bath? In the dirt. That's right. Bison take baths by wallowing in the dirt. Bison travel in large herds, primarily females with offspring. When males become mature, they live alone or in bachelor groups most of the year, joining the herd for mating season. When bison have a argument, they butt heads. The males fight for dominance every summer. Bison are true survivors. They once numbered into the tens of millions. They have survived two near extinctions. During the last ice age, bison roamed much of North America with mammoths, mastodons, and saber-toothed cats. Bison survived when many species did not. Bison had another near extinction in the late 1800s. People relentlessly hunted the bison for their fur and tongues. About 50 million bison were killed. There were only a few thousand left at the end of the 19th century. Luckily, some people decided to protect the bison. Bison are big, hairy, and sometimes scary. 